When you are eco printing, you can roll your fabric and vegetation up with no core. But because we are looking for direct contact prints, and we might want to modify the colors that we achieve, it can be great fun to roll our bundles up on different cores, such as metal pipes, wood, or twigs. And I like to have a selection of copper plumbing pipes, old cast iron pipes. I also have some aluminium pipes uh, in my studio. And I select the pipe that I use depending on the colors I'm hoping to achieve. For example, a copper pipe will give more golden yellow tones and a rusty metal or cast iron pipe will give darker tones. But if I don't want to have any color, but I do want something to roll the fabric up on, I might select a pipe, wrap that pipe in some waxed paper or greaseproof paper and roll up. And that waxed paper creates a barrier, but it still allows me roll the bundle up very easily. I could also choose to use twigs from my garden or eucalyptus branches. What happens in that case, though, is there will be a reaction with the tannin in the timber or the branch and the rusty metal in the pot. So I will get different reactions where that twig or branch is making direct contact with the fabric. But those are just some suggestions for you. Copper, cast iron, rusty metal, a wooden dowel, some twigs, all options for you to roll your bundles up on and achieve interesting effects when eco-printing in the dirty pot.